In this tip of the day, let's take a closer look at the 1CNC rotate command. In fact, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how we can rotate any geometry in reference to a construction plane coordinate system. Alright, so to begin with, let's create a brand new construction plane. I'm going to head down to the lower left hand corner, go into our construction plane tools, and I'm going to use this option right here where I can create a construction plane through three points. I'm just going to take my cursor left click, left click, and left click the third point and what that's done now is created a brand new construction plane. In fact, let's turn on the marker so we can see exactly how the axes are set up for this construction plane. Alright, so the red point on the axis gnome that is X positive, the green point is Y positive, and the blue is Z positive. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to take this part and we're going to rotate it 45 degrees in reference to this construction plane around its Z axes. So to begin with, we need to select the geometry. I'm going to hit Control A, Control Alpha on the keyboard. Now let's go into the Rotate command. And here we need to digitize or specify a point to rotate around. I think I'm just going to left click right there as the center of rotation. Now once we do that, we're going to come over here to the Command Manager and we're going to be focusing on these three options right here because these three options, these three parameters rotate the part around the current construction plane coordinate system and we decided we want to rotate the part 45 degrees. Once we've done that, we can click OK. Let's deselect our geometry and now you can see as I rotate this around, we've rotated the part 45 degrees around the z-axis of the current construction planes coordinate system. Very, very powerful. Alright, that's it for this tip of the day. Thank you so much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.